Hi again, welcome to the Frugal Studio. I made an easel from a laptop portable desk stand. Not so long ago I bought a portable laptop desk stand for my laptop from a thrift store for eight bucks. Looking at how the stand worked with a tilting panel and a side table presumably for the mouse, I got to thinking that it would make a great compact and very cheap easel. I saw online a great concept for just this idea. I couldn't find a price for it, but the copy indicated assembly was required, and I thought the shipping costs alone would not be frugal. This conversion couldn't be simpler. All I had to do was flip the tilting panel and unscrew the armature. I discarded the lopped laptop panel. Using the same screws, I attached a piece of plywood that I already had, which measured roughly 22 by 23 inches. If you're planning to use this easel for watercolor, you may want to make the panel, the plywood panel 24 by 20 inches to accommodate a half sheet of watercolor paper. The beauty of this stand is that depending on which way you flip the plywood panel, it can be used for both left-handed and right-handed artists. You should determine which handed you are and attach the strip of wood at the bottom of the plywood panel on the correct side. Right-handed artists will probably want the flat fixed stationary panel on the right side and left-hand artists on the left side. Speaking of that panel, you could also drill holes into it to accommodate some plastic cups to hold brushes and water. I'm positive you can come up with other attachment ideas to customize the easel to, you, to meet your needs. I built this easel myself and I use it for a number of purposes including drawing, painting, and writing. Many thanks for watching. There are many more Frugal Studio projects coming. Subscribe to my channel and be notified of the informative and enjoyable upcoming Frugal Studio projects. Take a minute and leave a thumbs up and or a comment. And if you have ideas you'd like to share, by all means send them to me. I would enjoy hearing from you.